Lafayette is taking the initiative to get greener. For the last couple of weeks, the city has been part of a recycling education program to try and reduce waste found at Columbian Park. We got a closer look at the process and found out going green isn't always clean. Take this. David Colmer is putting waste in its place. Pray it's not disgusting. And it's no easy process. For weeks, he's been dumping, sorting, and ditching. Lafayette hired on Calmer to help out with a 10 week recycling study called the Indiana Sustainability Development Program. Certainly, parks and recreation are all about uh, sustainability and being very green. And I knew that we had some challenges uh, currently with our recycling program, so it seemed like a terrific fit. Calmer is an IU student studying sustainability. Now he's applying what he knows so Lafayette can be greener. Well, I was hired on to kind of just provide recommendations of, of the waste. Stream. Here's how the study works. First, he dissects the trash found in Columbian Park. This waste sort aspect of it, I scheduled for seven days in a row to kind of capture the total waste that's generated within a week in this park. And what he found was downright dirty. The numbers suggest that roughly by volume, um, 47% of the overall waste being thrown away is recyclable. Then he takes what he finds and recommends ways to minimize waste generated on the park's grounds. And what we'll do is we'll use that information as a springboard to really start focusing in on our own recycling program and how we actively get started. All in all, Calmer says he's here to make recycling an easy couple second process. The goal is to, to make it easy within those two seconds to um, make it clear, make the signage easy to read so they know what to recycle and what not to. In addition to the waste sort, Lafayette Parks and Recreation is asking people to fill out a survey that will help with the future recycling program in the city's parks. You can find that survey on our website at WFI.com.